I don't want to play Monopoly. <laughs> Is that bad? Would that be weird? I just, I just think like just something different. Where's my, where's my? Nope, that's not the button. Where's my description? Um, Monopoly. I haven't seen the Monopoly GameCube version. And I'm just curious what it looks like. See a dangerous thing you added to Redeems. Vote for which Shrek game in the first. Yeah, Shrek Super Party. Okay, so I opened Shrek Super Party just to make sure that it would run on the emulator. And what I, I literally screamed when I opened it. I opened Shrek Super Party and I went, ah! <laughs> because, because why? Because why? Hold on, I have a voting chart. Thank you for voting, Power. Currently, Shrek Extra Large is in the lead, if you're curious. You got like 10 homers in the period of 30 seconds. <laughs> I just, I... <laughs> it's every time I start to do good, that game is just, it's, it's like, it, it says no. It just, no. Get wrecked. There's no, there's no slot B. There's no slot B game. I don't know what you want. I got Monop this! I believe in you! <laughs> Thank you, Crota Pirate. Although I do feel like, I don't know, like, playing playing Monopoly when I'm slightly irate from, um, I love Monopoly, though. I'm slightly irate from the whole baseball thing. This is insane. What is, this is not a Monopoly motif. This is so goofy looking. Options? Pro Why would I need a pro, no, I don't, no. Stop. Why would I need a profile? Tutorial. It's Monopoly. Settings. Okay. Uh. Game type. Party. Classic. Uh. Pa pa par party, I guess? Select theme. Classic. Sci fi. Fantasy. Prehistoric. Ancient monuments. Oh, I like the sci-fi one. That looks neat. U.S. dollars or euros. Or pounds. Well, that's nice of them to give that to me. No, I know, no, I don't want- PUNISHMENT?! With maximum punishment turned on, players cannot take part in auctions, trade, buy houses, or receive rent while in prison. Oh, these are house rules. These are- these are wild house rules. Oh. Oh. No, no, no. <laughs> Blurry. Thank you, dwarf. I always- I always- I appreciate you letting me know, because my camera likes to do that. Thank you, Dwarf. I'm not surprised that you were horrified by Super Party. A vote for Super Party is a vote for torture. But Super Party is short, right? Shrek Super Party is short. I guess I'll just make it me and another player. Player one. My name is... No. 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 Well. No. Back. Uh, player. No, can I change my name? Um, what's my Monopoly name? How are there that many Shrek games? There are five Shrek games, isn't that exciting? <laughs> Not even sure that it's all the ones on GameCube. It's it's not. I left out Shrek 2 because I know we're not doing Shrek 2 first. But there are five there are five Shrek games. Um I think How many 
characters do I get? Eight? Um... What's his name? Mr. Monopoly? Uncle Rich Pennybags? Uh, this is... This is Greb. Yes. Okay. Uh, slot A. Would you like to save Greb? Yeah, we'll save Greb. How do you win- do I just need to win a game of Monopoly? I, I haven't thought about this, I just- I downloaded Monopoly the other day because I wanted to play it, but it, it's clear to me now that the NES game is- is far superior. This is why I don't understand what's happening in front of me. This is wild. <laughs> oh, what? He gets to choose a token first? Lunar Rover. Oh, ew. Oh, icky. Oh, I don't like that. Astronaut, alien, UFO. Um, I like the astronaut. I like the alien. I think I like the alien. Um, I don't like any of these buildings. I guess I like this one. It looks like a piece of sushi. That's double four. Double four. Po Pokeopoly. <laughs> Do you want to Which Shrek movie property? is best? See, I need to rewatch all the Shrek movies because everybody says. Congratulations! Who will start the bidding? What, why are we bidding? What are we bidding on? Any more bids? Um. Greb. Player one has raised the bid. Greb, why are we? This is a hundred dollar property. What are we doing? I have a new bid. Okay. What a bidding war. Wh That's double one. Okay. So is Monopoly Party? You're it's that we're going visiting. at the same time. I don't know. I hear Shrek 2 is the best Shrek movie, but I'm gonna rewatch them all. This property? That's double one. Hey rent. Oh, he oh Fred's paying me. Okay. This I'm glad the N64 was only alive for four years. I got spared. <laughs> Wait, did you do Pumpkin Pie Man, did you do all those N64 games? This property is vacant. Do you want to buy it? Or is that what you're currently doing? That's Ooh. another property for your portfolio. Oh, I got the big blue property. What a oh, great yeah. piece of real estate you just bought. Get you my go money, tax. tax. This isn't even Monopoly, this is Press A Simulator. This property is vacant. Solar panel it? farm. <sighs> utilities are never utilities never give enough on return. I fear you. Who will start the bidding? I don't I Oh wait, what is this? I have a new bid. Layer one has raised the bid. <sighs> These I purple ones bid. are not worth anything now. Oh, they're still purple in this game. They're not brown yet. Player one has raised the bid. Who will start the bidding? Did you guys know Chris Farley was originally meant to be the voice actor for Shrek? Anyone I did not else? know that. Huh, I wonder if that would be... Anyone else? I wonder how that would be different. I feel like Mike Myers does an excellent Shrek. Player two has raised the bid. Oh, I didn't actually want that. I was just trying to bid you up. 
That's Gosh it. darn it. <laughs> uh, not blinking out of space. Oh, Get out of control. <laughs> It, Monopoly is out of control. Monopoly is absolutely out of control. I personally am excited for the McDonald's Monopoly game to come back next month. Do you want to buy this property? Oh, I can't buy this property. Who will start the bidding? Well, I already know. I already know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bid as high as I can. Oh shoot! Wait, I can't bid that high. Any more bids? I can't bid anymore. Let me not. <laughs> That's it for oh. this auction. And sixty four is what I'm doing. I still got one ninety left. Okay, okay, okay. I I don't know why I thought you were doing one of the handhelds consoles. Um, I mean, like what, like the Game Boy Color. Or Game Boy Advance or something. But, okay, N64. I gotta remember that. Um, I'm sorry, what's happening? What is the deal? You want to give me $277 for my red property? Um, how do I... Can I see the board? You're covering up all the colors. I don't know what everybody owns. Uh Counter offer. Counter offer. Oh, I see now. You own you own the other two reds. That's I see now. I understand now. Um, what if instead, uh, I get all the reds, <laughs> and you can have, um, oh, uh, you can have, no, no, go back, no, 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 none of th these menus are horrible. Um, un undo, undo, ha go back, back, back. Oh, it's frozen. Maybe my emulator, maybe my computer's just broken. Maybe my computer's just broken. I, cause I, now I'm, okay, well. Oh. It's not. Okay, it's just. It's just. <laughs> I just. I upset the game. I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't know that it was gonna. That the. That the. I don't. <sighs> I didn't know. I didn't know. Forgot McDonald's did Monopoly. Haven't seen or heard about that since the 90s. Yeah, it's coming back in like a week or two. I like the McDonald's Monopoly. It always convinces me to buy McDonald's for no good reason. <laughs> uh, AI loves giving comically terrible deals for the player in video games. It does, and I... Yeah, uh, I wonder, like, how... How comically terrible do you think they'll accept a deal? Let me... Uh, let me just, just... 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 Creosis? Who... Okay. Okay, that's not your... That's not the standard Monopoly name I thought you were gonna go with. Okay. How 
can you trade? How can you? Oh, okay. Oh, we have to. We have to. Sorry, we have to start the game first. No, he took my alien. Um. Okay. If we. If. if do you think he'll just like? What if I buy something and trade him for it and take all of his money? How about adding this property to your collection? How do you Do I have any takers? Oh, um Player 1 has raised Why does this guy bed? auction everything? What a steal. Okay, well what if that's it for this auction. Where's the trade? Where's the Do trade I have auction? Any takers? Stop auctioning things. I'm trying to figure out how to trade with you. I have a new bid. I have a new bid. I have a new bid. Man, the NES version of Monopoly is so much better than this. I have a new bid. Stop with your single dollars. What do you do? Okay, you can have that for $258. You can have that. Do I hear any more bids? Is it is it one of the like double five? Is it one of the other buttons? Oh, oh. You can move the board. How about adding this property Dude, to your collection? Take, take your turn, man. That's double six. Is it? Is it? It's not pause. Advance to the nearest. Is he still taking his turn? Is that what it is? Take your turn faster. You owe rent to player two. Congratulations on your acquisition. This property Dude, is for take sale. your turn you faster. My lord, I'm trying to I I just want to see how to You've won second prize in a laser light show My goodness. contest. Emulators never have 100% coverage except the really old ones. That's another property. Yeah, it's um you know, the emulator is never, it's never perfect. This property is for sale. Do you want to buy it? No, I, hold on, I want to trade. How does one trade? No, that's not the button. You're just visiting. Do you want to the buy The world may property? never know. Literally... Liter literally, that's all of the buttons. Do you want to buy this property? Trigger, trigger, Z button, X. Y moves the thing. A A will roll the dice. B C stick does nothing. D pad does nothing. Control stick. Every direction, nothing. This is not a good version of Monopoly. Go to jail. Move directly to jail. Do not pass go. Do not. Who will start the bidding? Player two has raised the bid. Once again, you got- Did I get snake eyes when I started again? Do Jeez. I hear any more bids? I just- I- 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 Player one has raised the bid. I didn't- I didn't think, um... I didn't think the Monopoly game would be that complicated. I've just been wanting to play Monopoly lately, and so when we saw it, I was like, oh, that'll be fun. That was incorrect. That was incorrect of me. Advance to Starship Square. This property is for sale. Do you want to buy it? I, cause I, I just... Imagine Monopoly being any kind of fun. I like Monopoly. I like the board game Monopoly. Hold on, I'm gonna open up my manuals to see if it'll tell me how to... How to initiate a trade. 
I so I I really like Monopoly as a board game, and I don't know why. I think it's the paper money part. I think it's just fun to be the banker. Oh, Monopoly party. I do have a I have a manual for this. Okay. Um. Saving and loading. Play sequence. Playing the game. Landing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, where's trades? Trades. 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 Trades? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Press the A button to, in, to do the dice. Yeah, obviously. Uh, okay. Auctions, doubles. Uh huh. End of turn. Once all other matters have resolved, all players are free to attend to other business, such as initiating a trade or paying off a mortgage. When you're finished with your turn, press the A button. While in summary view to indicate that you are ready to roll the die. That doesn't make any sense! You rolled double four! Okay, so I land there. Do you want to buy this property? Who will start the bidding? Oh my gosh, just bid by tens. Player two has raised the bid. Okay, you can you can have that. Talk about buying cheap. And then it doesn't it doesn't give you any button directions on how you would make a trade. That was a toughie. <laughs> There's nothing in the manual. Press the L button to toggle your player window. Oh, is he initiating a trade? Did I initiate a trade? Hold on. What? <laughs> I need to stop streaming. I think I just need to give it up. I don't know. I can't I can't ever get my camera to focus. Um every game seems to crash. Oh hi Lime, how are you? Uh, Monopoly is best when everyone is heated as in each other's throats. That's the other thing, is that Monopoly is way more fun with other people. There's nothing fun about um what what hold on grab to no creosis to grab um creosis gives grab sixty seven dollars and and and, good God, these are the worst menus I've ever seen in my entire life. Previous. Pre previous. My good Lord. Am I? I'm player one. Here. Um, those are mine now. These are also, these are mine now. That's mine now. Nope. That's that's mine now. This is all mine now. Now it's all mine. And give me all your money too. I, <laughs> I just. What is the worst deal a uh, the AI will make? Propose. Mm. Apparently not that bad a deal. <laughs> uh. 
Monopoly is fun when everybody plays with completely different rules. You I don't- I don't love, win. like, the house rules of Monopoly. Look at Capitalist Poke go, hi Carsonian, how are you? Monopoly is fun. Monopoly is fun. It's this version's not. You rolled double one. You sell some star stock. How do you? I never figured it out. I never figured out the trading thing. I think he initiated the trading, right? How about adding this property to your collection? Why is Monopoly in outer space? Things are getting out of control. Monopoly is out of control, I'm telling you. Doing well, did you get your Starbucks today? No, I woke up too late, so I couldn't go before work. So I, um... I have plans to get my, my pumpkin spice drink tomorrow. That's it for this auction. Please let me, please let me make a trade. Let me have all of his money. Go back three spaces. This sucks. Maybe it's the party version of the game that sucks. This property is vacant. Do you want to buy it? You owe player two. That one's more normal than this Monopoly. Yeah, this Monopoly is super weird. I I. I don't- Do you want to like, I just don't get it. Property? Do I hear any bid? Ugh, and this- okay, we have to up the AI level because I them auctioning off every property is incredibly annoying. Oh, I don't I have, have money for this. Bid. Oops. That's it for this auction. We were both in the poorhouse. I- I mean, honestly. Looks like you owe some rent. Uh, this version is stressful. Hi, Tilda! This version, it doesn't make any sense! I don't get it! <laughs> Milky Way. Uh, oh, hi, Cougar, how are you? For house rules, like you don't get money on free parking, right? House rules, no, house rule is you do get money on free parking. The free parking money thing is a house rule. That's not an official Monopoly rule. You've declared your debt to Greb. Okay. So, oh, finally, there's the menu. You, wait, wait, wait. You have to do it before you roll. You have to do it before you roll. It's not after you roll. The manual is a liar. Okay. Trade. Okay. Um, give me this for... Uh, I bet- I- I wonder if they'd take it for that. Um, stop with the comments! Propose. Nope, okay. <laughs> um, so, wait, did they counter? Propose. Oh, they just reject. Okay, I guess I'll cancel then. My bad. We'll just play Press A Simulator then. Uh, oh, thank you guys for the hydrate. <laughs> this property is for sale. Do you want to buy it? I think this game sucks. This game being Monopoly in general, or this specific version of Monopoly Lime? <laughs> Just visiting. You owe rent to play. I don't two. care that I owe rent. None of this is interesting at all. It's not even visually appealing. You owe rent to player one. It's in outer space, nothing makes sense. Why are you buying Neptune? Seems like it should be slightly more expensive. You rolled Rolls we'll make it boring. What we need is Candyland. Oh, Candyland! Wow, I haven't property? played that in a long I time. I got Black Hole Square for a dollar. I was just hitting A. I don't even. I'm not sure what happened. That's double one. 
Remember having a game of Candyland as a kid where the board got thrown and pieces got strewed all over the house? Oh no! You must pay the empaths. Wow, yeah, I used to play Candyland with my sister all the time. But... I, I mean, I don't- I probably haven't played it in 15, 20 years. You rolled That's wild, I haven't even thought about Candyland in a long time. Player one rank. Think of house rules as Go like casino rules to jail. or the official rules, family rules, or where you just make things up. Yeah. Oh, go to jail. You oh no, poor me. Jail. Pay to get out? Nope, I'm good. You owe rent to player one. Both this game and Monopoly. Well, okay, that's fine. You're allowed to feel your feelings, but this game does suck. I agree. What do I have to do to win this game? Do I just need to win one game of Monopoly, or just do I win on every board, or what? I didn't even think about it. I just clicked on Monopoly. You've had three chances to roll a double. You must hey, Pokey, now happy Friday. I hope you're having a good Monopoly party. Hi, Big Tall. Thanks for popping in. I I was I was you having a good Friday until my baseball game crashed services. four times uh, and every single time I was winning when it did that so I'm pretty bitter about it you and then I made a very stupid decision one. and opened Monopoly and that was dumb I shouldn't have done that I should have just left this alone <laughs> you owe player one. doing amazing sweetie wow look at her go. Am I doing amazing? I can't tell. <laughs> Grab full set. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Grab has a full set. Jeez. I grew up in a risk household, which explains a lot. Game ends when the credits roll. Well, I don't know when the credits roll. <laughs> You must pay your college fee. It makes you hate Monopoly all boards. It's just it's boring. This is such a boring way to play Monopoly. Do you want to buy this property? F for baseball game. That sucks. It really sucks. It sucked so suck. It was so sucky. Cause I've been having I was having a hard time in that baseball game anyway, and then it'd be like, oh, here's a grand slam. Oh, here, um, the game's sucks to suck. You get you don't get to play the game anymore. You were winning. That's Take too bad. To Kennedy Space Center. Oh my God! Everything on the board is owned. This property is vacant. Oh good. Grab full set. It? Okay. Let me, let me, let me build. Well, what do I own? I own the purple. My god, I don't own anything good. Trade. Alright. Trade. No, okay. Trade. Alright. Um, here. I want this. I want this. Ooh. Uh. You can have that. All right, there. <sighs> Creosius is such a little prick. Okay, well, what if... Um... Um... Here, you know what? How about instead... I get all these. You can have these. Will you do it for a Monopoly? Dang it. <laughs> I bet it I bet it says it has to be an equal trade. At least. Hey! Okay. <laughs> That's fine. The purples are the worst, worst monopolies in the dang game. All right. You rolled double free. Buy houses and bankrupt everyone. Like that's the whole. That's the whole game. That's the whole game. You make your friends feel bad about themselves. That's that's all. That's the whole game. 
Need a modded GameCube fund for Pokey. Would probably have better compatibility with the library. I need to get one too. Yeah, I was talking. Yeah, yeah. Pumpy Pie Man was ta was talking about his modded, um, his modded GameCube setup, and it I it is. Yep, that's just what. It's it's what I need. <laughs> my poor my poor my poor 2014 emulating computer is. Boy, it we are we are pressing our luck every single day that we turn the computer on. It's- it's a miracle I get to stream it all, ever. <laughs> you owe some rent. You've discovered a new oxygen source. You've discovered oxygen? What is this? <laughs> this is not Monopoly. Um... Buildings. Um... I have three monopolies. Congratulations on building your first. Oh, house. turns out I'm poor. Um. Okay, I built those. Where is? I don't even know what's happening on the board. There's no strategy. It's just, it's just press A simulator. To go. I have all the mods that's in my about if you're interested. Ooh, that's sick. Oh, that's so generous, Pumpkin Pie Man. Oh, that's so good that you have that ready to go. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look into that when I'm done pretending to play Monopoly. Oh, sick. Thank you. I'm surprised how few board games there are on GameCube. This might be the only one unless you count the poker game. I know, right? Isn't it insane how little, like... Um... No game shows, and this is the only board game. It's- it's crazy to me. Uh... Where is- That's double two! Where are you? Free parking? Hold on, don't move. I'm trying to find where you are. There you are. Okay, I see him moving at the top of the screen now. I have not looked at this board once. I've just been clicking A. You owe player one rent. Oh, he was right in my crosshairs, and I didn't... I didn't do the thing in time. Building. That's another build. To your collection. Build. Build. I'm one dollar short. <laughs> That's double three. Do you want to buy this property? Uh, okay. You now own the whole color set. Oh, what did I get a color set of? I don't even know what we're doing. Free parking. Creotius, babe. I don't know what you think you're gonna you do with putting all of these hotels four. and properties on on the on the purple you spaces. I'm not gonna land on those. One of those is like the Double least landed on six. space in Monopoly. Free parking. You're safe. You roll double six. Got an N64 HDMI mod. Gotta get an N64 console to install it. Dang, you got the setups, Big Tall. That's going to be expensive. You're so fortunate that you don't have to do a lot of traditional board games with this challenge. I'm Looks fortunate like in a lot of ways with win. this challenge, just just, just not in the actual hardware part. <laughs> I fell short in the hardware department, so all of the games were like, eh, we'll, we'll give her some softballs. It's just, no, nothing's gonna be too hard. Everything's gonna be kind of okay. You owe There's win. not a lot of stinkers on the GameCube. What are you trading me? Oh yeah, right. What? Seven dollars? Alright, what if I give you that? Um, and you give me... Whoops. 
all of your money. This is how my this is how my family plays Monopoly. It's like, yes, I will make this trade with you, but you have to give me all of your money. <laughs> Oh, wait. What? Did I not? Hold on. What? Did that not go through? You rolled double free. Go directly huh. to Huh, okay, jail. I don't know what happened. I must have not clicked the right button. <laughs> How's it going? There are a few solutions. If you want to be more invasive, Pico Boot allows you to keep your CD drive run on some GameCube, but it requires soldering. Mmm. I don't have a soldering gun. You rolled double I'm very one. intimidated by soldering. I've only done it a couple times in my life, and they were all very low stakes situations. <laughs> Free parking. You're safe. You owe me a little sauce. She brought me some Korean food. Nice. Oh yeah, I should eat after this. I don't know why I'm I'm doing this instead of anything else with my time. Go to jail. Can I? You're in jail. Which means when you hop out, you're gonna come- you're gonna come touch all my properties. Um... Another house. Build... Uh, build... A house build... That's probably fine. Still having difficulty looking at the screen, it's making me sick. It's not- yeah, it is not good to look at. It is extremely... unappealing. I- I get what you're saying, Lime. And I don't think- the nearest utility. Can I change the view? Music... Guide comments- it says guide comments off, but it's lying because it keeps giving me comments. Animations... Uh, it's really, it's not an appealing board. I, I guess we, we could look at it like this. That's not any better. It, now you can see everything even more, somehow. Go to jail. Move directly to jail. Do not pass go. Do, do I have any takers? Ooh, Andromeda Avenue. Do I hear no, any I, more I don't. bids? I have a new bed. I don't want I don't I can't afford that. But there's no reason bed. there's no reason you should get it for cheap. I have a new bed. Two no, even more. Player one Oop, not that much more. The bed. There you go. It was 350, you can pay 378 for it now, you ding dong. That's land on my properties. Four. Yes, land land on all my properties. You owe rent yes. to player one. Land, 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 land on all you my owe. stuff. Wait, what? Oh, I have negative six dollars. <laughs> Oops. Um... Oh, well, let, I'm obviously gonna mortgage that. You rolled double five. How are you? I'm doing okay, Dwarf. It's been, um, it's, you know, we're having a stream. It's been a rough one, I gotta say. Baseball screwed me over big, big time. Oh, some rent. Point in this game where it's advantageous to stay in jail forever, so the strategy at some point is don't play the game. Well, not I mean, 
It's that's still strategy. Do you feel lucky? There's song Let's stuck in my head. I like, didn't even listen to that Hi Madam Masquerade, how are you? Oh hi Big Will, how are you? You owe player one rent. So does anybody might like Monopoly in the chat, or is it, is it just me, except for I'm also being a hater right now because this game sucks? Monopoly, the board game, I'm cool with. This, the board game, the video game, bad. The NES version of Monopoly is great. So I had, I don't know, I had hope, I guess? I'm getting very rich. Why am I? Get out of jail, free card. Hold on, wait. I don't care about that. No, nope. show me. Let me buy more houses. Where is he? Oh, he's coming around my bend. Let me buy more houses. You're becoming quite a house builder. Yeah. Buy those. Buy. Which one of these is Illinois Avenue? It's one of. It's one of these yellow ones, right? It doesn't matter. I got a new job as an accountant of sorts for school districts. I start Monday. Congrats, Duke New. How you feeling about it? You owe player one rent. Hi, Pokey. Me. It's frustrating though. Yeah, it it can be. I I I I'm glad there's someone else here who actually likes Monopoly as a as a board game. It does make me feel better. Because, like, I've been doing this deep dive research into Monopoly lately because I got really a little bit too obsessed with it for no good reason. You sell some stars. Um, and I read this whole book on the history of Monopoly, and it was really interesting. It's really it's so much more complicated you than it ever needed to be. One. And then I started looking you up all of the editions of Monopoly, and it's like, why do they make so many different versions of Monopoly. Why are there like 10,000 licensed versions of the game? <laughs> How many people are buying Monopoly? <laughs> For so many people who claim to not like it, they sell a lot of editions of Monopoly. I only like winning, which doesn't happen often. <laughs> Monopoly equals good, capitalism equals bad. <laughs> Monopoly to teach you the woes of capitalism. <laughs> Look at this. This guy has three dollars. Come on. This is not gonna this is not gonna last forever. I'm gonna build more stuff. Looks though. like you owe some rent. Monopoly's alright, but I'm more of a clue fellow. Oh, clue's a good one. Clue's underrated, I feel, you know? Nobody's ever busting out clue at the parties. That well maybe we should. All right, I think, there we go. Didn't the guy forget to copyright Monopoly, is that right? Okay, so you wanna know, so I'll go into it because I read this whole thing about Monopoly. I'll tell you about the history of Monopoly. <laughs> okay, so this lady, her name's Lizzie Maggie. She invents this game called The Landlord's Game in the late 1800s, early 1900s, because she believed in this tax theory, the single tax theory of Henry George. And so her concept was, okay, let me make this game to prove why capitalism is bad and we should use the single tax theory, which is where you're only taxed on land you that you own and nothing else. So that's the only thing that's taxable is if you're a landlord. And so there's two versions of that game where you can play it where it's like Monopoly and there's one winner who takes all the money or you can play it in the communistic way, the single tax theory way, and, and everybody shares the wealth. And that was her point. It was a teaching tool, okay? She uh, patented it. Oh God, wait. What are you, what is this guy transferring me for? Um, what is this? I don't know what- I don't even know what this trade is. I don't know what I'm looking at. Anyway, okay, so she patents it. She sells it. It's on the market. Um, she takes it to Parker Brothers, and Parker Brothers is like, No, this is too complicated. No, thank you. And so it goes around, people buy the game, 
most importantly is that it's this is so in the weeds but i'm gonna go into it <laughs> um most importantly is that people are making their own versions of her game so when she's teaching them she's teaching people in these single tax theory classes that she holds she's teaching them the game monopoly they're going home and making their own version of the board game so they're going home and laying out their own one instead of buying a copy and they're making them localized for themselves so that's how through a series of means we get to the Atlantic City version, because everybody's taking it to their own homes and making their own versions for their own places. So there are Quakers in Atlantic City who do their own version of this. God damn it, why do I have negative monies? Um, I'm supposed to be winning, why am I not winning? <laughs> You've landed on chance. Let's see what your card says. Okay, so this, so the, there's this Atlantic City version by these Quakers in Atlantic City, and Charles Darrow is taught from somebody who learned this Atlantic City version. He goes and he starts making his own copies rebate. of the Atlantic City one that he was taught, and starts to sell them, and they start to sell in stores. And then Parker Brothers, one, one of the wives of a Parker Brothers executive is like, hey. Did you see this game, Monopoly, that this guy came out with? Um, I'm I'm not the rent and literally all Charles Darrow did was he added some, he, big payout to, oh, sweet. Is he added some artwork. He added the artwork. That's it. It's, it's the same. He added artwork. And he, he like, mo he modernized, he cleaned up the layout. And he added artwork. And he copyrighted the artwork. And Parker Brothers came to him and is like, hey, we would like to buy your game. And they paid him seven grand plus residuals, which in 1930, 1935, was a crap load of money. Look at this. I'm making huge payouts. Just let me win the game already. <laughs> but here's the thing. Parker Brothers knows about the Landlord's game because, one, she sent it to them. Two, they owned another Maggie Lizzie game. She sold them a different game. They know who Maggie Lizzie is, uh, oh, uh, Lizzie Maggie is. So they have to go and buy her patent from her for $500. Like years, like like a couple years later. Siri, I, I heard you come on, Siri. Don't, nobody's talking to you. I'm I'm, I'm going off about the, the landlord. None of this is important. <laughs> you rolled. Anyway, they buy they buy her patent. They buy everybody's patents. Everybody who has a game even remotely like Monopoly, which a lot of people do because it became popular in a lot of different circles, they buy up all those patents and then they sue everybody that tries to make a Monopoly type game. And that works until the 1970s when this guy creates anti-Monopoly. And he's money, the one that dredges all this stuff up because something. he's like, this game shouldn't even be copyrighted. Maggie Lizzie created it in 1903. And Parker Brothers, for some reason, got a second patent on something that was already patented. Anyway, none of that's important. How's everybody else? <laughs> I just, I was hoping I could talk long enough that the game would end. <laughs> uh. Same reason there are so many Supermans so the company could hold onto the property. That's a, yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. What an impressive <laughs> hotel. Anyway, that book is called The Monopolis by that Mary Mary Pylon. It's an interesting book. She does a better job of explaining it than I just did. That's going to leave a big <laughs> hole in your pocket. Uh, hello, the history of Monopoly is a mess. I had no idea. It is. It's a disgusting mess. Second patent, so she only got $500. Yes, You're okay. So, so yeah. Features. So, so... Charles Darrow copyrighted his artwork and stuff, but he didn't get a patent. Parker Brothers went to the patent office and they were like, hey, we would like to patent Monopoly. And they were like, ooh, this is, looks exactly like the landlord's game. You're going to need to own that patent too, which is why they bought they bought At Lizzie Maggie's patent. For $500 and no re residuals. Do you believe that? Isn't that insane? They gave Charles Darrow $7,000 plus residuals, and his first year of residuals was fi over $5,000. And they're like, yeah, Maggie Lizzie, uh, we really only need this patent so we can legally patent Monopoly, because it's just an updated form of the game. That's a double! 
I remember seeing that book when I worked at a bookstore, and I thought it would be a good read. Way. I haven't read it, though. I do actually really recommend it, because it's... Um, again, she does a way better job of explaining it than I do. But are you done yet, sir? Are you... Sorry to could Creosius just go out of the game? I know I'm going to win. When you need the money, <laughs> you've got to sell something. But yeah, it goes way deep into that 1970s lawsuit with the guy who created Anti-Monopoly. Because he, he really dredged all this history up. It was kind of like, it was talked about at the time, and then Parker Brothers just sued the crap out of everybody. And then when just kept suing the, the money, crap out of everybody so that it wouldn't come up. So that, po so that, not Pokemon, <laughs> Monopoly wouldn't be in the public domain. That's double one. Go to jail. Move but I think, like, according to current Not copyright laws, it's supposed to come into the public domain in, like, 2030 or something. So that's going to be interesting. How they're going to deal with that. What's anti-monopoly? So in the 1970s, this guy created anti-monopoly, and his goal was basically to be like, capitalism's bad. Here's a, here's a, here's a communistic like form of the game Monopoly. Some property. Um... Yes! Bankrupt! There we go. <laughs> Greb wins. This is a hideous game to look at. I, I did not enjoy it. I hear it's not very good. Anti-Monopoly isn't very good. But Parker Brothers sued him, and he was like, hey, um, don't do that. <laughs> Monopoly, Monopoly is not... It's too generic of a term. And that lawsuit went on for nine years, and he eventually won. And he dredged up all that stuff. That's how we know the history of Monopoly now. But he lost that lawsuit at first, and they buried 40,000 copies of his game underground in, in Minnesota. And now, now there are houses built on top of 40,000 copies of Anti-Monopoly. <laughs> And that's all my that's all my Monopoly fun facts. Is beating one version of this enough? Do I need to beat all of them? Just, there are five themes. I'm not going to do them right now. I'm just asking for future reference. Ancient monuments, prehistoric, fantasy, sci-fi, classic. The course of Monopoly was full of awful people taking advantage of less fortunate. Yes. Yeah. Making mon monopo monopolizing Monopoly is the history of Monopoly. <laughs> Stayed on every everything. 100% Monopoly. <laughs> this is beta Mario Party. Yeah. As a beta myself, I this is my favorite form of Mario Party. <laughs> Hi, Harsh. Uh, Harsh, you're just in time. I was just about to leave. <laughs> Night Pokemon chat, I'm gonna eat this Korean food and KO. See you tomorrow. Have a great night, dwarf. Thanks for hanging out. I'm also think I think that's enough for me today. I I did a lot of baseball and some bad Monopoly, and now everybody's been poorly educated. I did not do a great job of explaining. Poorly educated on the history of Monopoly. <laughs> Alright, well I'll consider that game one and then and then maybe I'll do the rest of the versions of Monopoly some other time. I would win one mode, then check out another to see if it's different. If they're all the same, I'd just say win one. I like that. That's I could play a classic game. I think that's what I'll do. I did the party version. Maybe we'll do the classic version and call that good. We'll do that another night. <laughs> I ho yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed their, their schooling, their, their Monopoly lesson. Um, is there somebody we can raid out to? <laughs> So nobody has to look at or think about Monopoly anymore. Um, let's see who's online. Uh, let's raid. Let's raid Dave. Let's raid Dave. Raid Dave Dingo and Aussie, who is playing Alan Wake. 
Um, he's very chill and very funny, and he plays horror games. We like Dave, and we're gonna go say hi to Dave as soon as I figure out all the buttons are correct. <laughs> well, okay. Anyway, thank you. This is a weird stream. I'm gonna be real. This is a weird time. Tosses a dwarf. <laughs> You guys have a good night. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for spending your time with me. It was a weird time, but I, I appreciate you being here with me. <laughs> have a good night, everyone. Have a great weekend. Tomorrow, I'm going to be back playing Zelda. We're going to do... I'm going to finish the Water Temple. I'm actually going to do that tomorrow, so... Have a good night. We'll, we'll do that tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> oh, good lord. My whole dang life is a mess. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you, Lime, if you're still here. I always appreciate when you come by the stream. I also like to I like to vamp a little in the outro because I know that uh, I know that the dwarf will always will always will always kick around for just a second. <laughs> dwarf returns tomorrow. Heck yeah! Have a good night, dwarf. Get some rest. Get some, be prepared for stream. We're excited to see you again.